Warning. Palisades reportedly to poise to face-to-face -face encounter with Sussex's surprise UK return. Prince Harry and Meghan Markle are weighing up whether to attend, and bring Archie and Lilibet, to the Princess Diana statue event at Kensington Palace later this month, it is reported. Prince Harry and Meghan Markle could make a surprise return to the UK to attend a party to celebrate Princess Diana, according to reports. The Sussexes are said to be weighing up whether to go to the event scheduled to take place later at Kensington Palace this month. Harry, 37, flew back to the UK in July in order to attend the unveiling of the statue with his brother in honor of their late mother. Members of the Spencer family were also present at the unveiling, including Diana's brother Earl Spencer and sisters Lady Sarah McCorkadale and Lady Jane Fellows, but a reception was shelved due to COVID-19 restrictions. Since then, travel restrictions from the US have been lifted so the Sussexes would not be required to quarantine upon arrival. A source told, no one knows what Harry's decision is but there are rumblings that he may come with Meghan and their two children. Ingrid Seward, editor-in-chief at Majesty magazine, said of the reception, you would have thought it would definitely be something Harry would really want to be at. I can't imagine anything less important for him because he would want to respect his mother. The palace has not commented on the rumors but it is believed that Harry wanted to return for the celebration. At the unveiling of the statue in July, the brothers were understood to have come to an unspoken agreement to put their feud behind them and make the day about their late mother. The potential return comes 16 months after the Sussexes moved to California and as Harry works on a memoir due to be published late next year. Earlier this year, Harry and Meghan, Duchess of Sussex accused one unnamed royal of making offhand comments about their son's skin color. The couple has not revealed the royal's identity, but an expert believes Harry could be pressured to do so in his memoir. Harry and Meghan had a tell-all interview with Oprah Winfrey, where they alleged the royal made racially charged comments about their son, Archie because of Meghan's biracial background. Meghan told Oprah there were concerns and conversations about how dark his skin might be when he's born. She also specified these conversations were between Harry and his family that he relayed to her. The Sussexes withheld the name of the royal, but many viewers were quick to speculate about who it could be. After the interview, Winfrey shared that, according to Harry and Meghan, the person was not Queen Elizabeth or Prince Philip. The Sussexes have been shying away from sharing the royal's name. However, author Penny Jenner, who has written many books about the royal family, believes there could be pressure for Harry to release their identity. The publishers are going to want a lot for their money, such as naming this so-called racist, Jenner said. The outlet reported that Harry received an advance of $20,353,500 from his publisher, Penguin Random House. The Sussexes could also face legal consequences if they were to name the royal in question, according to a legal expert. The words may have had a racist overtone but were they intended in that way? English solicitor Mark Stevens told Mail Plus. Stevens added, essentially what you will find is that the individual, if named, may have been able to sue for libel and breach of privacy if it was a private conversation between two individuals where there was a reasonable expectation of privacy and for the contents of the conversation not to be shared with a third party, the media. Royals often follow the rule of never complain, never explain when faced with accusations. As such, some people might believe the racist royal would not retaliate. However, Stevens disagreed. The royal approach until very recently has been to never complain and never explain but they have moved away from that so I do wonder, Stevens noted. They will have to step up on them at some point, as long as they go uncontroverted some people will believe the truth of them. They go uncontroverted